Health in Jordan, Wikipedia Audio Jordan has an advanced health care system, although services remain highly concentrated in Amman. Government figures have put total health spending in 2002 at some 7.5% of gross domestic product, while international health organizations place the figure even higher, at approximately 9.3% of GDP. Jordan was ranked by the World Bank to be the number one medical tourism provider in the Arab region and among the top five in the world, as well as being the top medical tourism destination in the Middle East and North Africa. The country's health care system is divided between public and private institutions. In the public sector, the Ministry of Health operates 1,245 primary health care centers and 27 hospitals, accounting for 37% of all hospital beds in the country. The military's Royal Medical Services runs 11 hospitals, providing 24% of all beds, and the Jordan University Hospital accounts for 3% of total beds in the country. The private sector provides 36% of all hospital beds, distributed among 56 hospitals. According to 2003 estimates, the rate of prevalence of human immunodeficiency virus-slash-acquired immune deficiency syndrome was less than 0.1%. According to a United Nations Development Program report, Jordan has been considered malaria-free since 2001, cases of tuberculosis declined by half during the 1990s, but tuberculosis remains an issue in an area needing improvement. Jordan experienced a brief outbreak of bird flu in March 2006. Non-communicable diseases such as cancer also are a major health issue in Jordan. Childhood immunization rates have increased steadily over the past 15 years, by 2002 immunizations and vaccines reached more than 95% of children under 5. About 70% of Jordanians had medical insurance in 2007. The Jordanian government planned to reach 100% in 2011. However, in 2017, the Jordanian National Health Council reported that the health insurance coverage is still at 70%. The King Hussein Cancer Center is the only specialized cancer treatment facility in the Middle East. It is one of the top cancer treatment facilities in the world attracting patients from around the world, even from the West. In 2008, 250,000 patients sought treatment in the kingdom including Iraqis, Palestinians, Sudanese, Syrians, GCC citizens, Americans, Canadians, and Egyptians. Jordan generated over $1 billion in 2008 from medical tourism. Jordan is an emerging medical tourism destination, with related revenues exceeding $1 billion in 2007. More than 250,000 patients from other countries sought treatment in Jordan that year. This included an approximately 45,000 Iraqis. 25,000 Palestinians, 25,000 Sudanese, 1,800 U.S. citizens, 1,200 U.K. citizens, and 400 Canadians. Treatment costs can be as low as 25% of costs in the U.S. The World Bank ranked Jordan as being the top medical tourism destination in the Middle East and North Africa followed by Dubai, Abu Dhabi, and Israel. Life expectancy in Jordan was 74 years in 2013. 99% of Jordan's population have access to clean water and sanitation despite it being one of the world's poorest in water resources. There were 203 physicians per 100,000 people in the years 2000-2004 
a proportion comparable to many developed countries and higher than most of the developing world.